Hi there, and welcome back to Birdseed. In this video, we're gonna talk about the email capture tool and how you can put it in your Birdseed panel uh, and get some information for people that are visiting your website. So right now I'm in the customized tools section of the Birdseed dashboard that I have open. And I'm gonna go ahead and go to add tool at the top of the screen and I'm gonna choose email capture to get visitors to opt in to my email list, right? So drop that in there. As soon as it loads, you'll see that I have the new email capture tool ready to go. You see it says get a free custom site evaluation. That's just a just a generic piece of text that you can edit there. So hit the downward arrow to edit this and you're gonna see that I have uh, my settings ready to go. So right away I can see, okay, this says get a free custom site evaluation. You can change this to whatever you want. So let's say um, join our news letter, right? Um, and then underneath that, I can go ahead and see that I have get more info. This is the video that we have from Birdseed. You can replace this with your own media if you want to. You can do like a GIF, um, upload a file from your computer, use a YouTube or Vimeo video that you can change right here, put the link in there, or even a custom embed, or even record yourself doing a uh, specific video um, for this tool right there. We're just gonna leave that as is for now, but you can change that if you want to, um, or you can just remove it entirely. Below that we have our panel title, so get your free custom website evaluation. Uh, that is this right here uh, in the actual panel preview. So again, I can say uh, maybe don't, ah, we'll actually do this, join our newsletter. And then below that we have the intro text, which is right here, this little small paragraph. So here I'm gonna say um, don't miss out on all the great news about our company moving forward. There we go. And then below that, we have the ability to change the visibility. So again, working hours, after hours, or always, depends on when you want this to be available. And again, you can edit your hours of operation uh, for your business by clicking this link here or going to the settings in the panel settings as well. Uh, we'll leave that for now. Below that, you have custom text. So there's things you can change if you wanna change like uh, just success text or um, you know, if someone were to send an email, you can say register, things like that. Just you can change the wording if you want to. Uh, and then below that, we have the ability to build our form. So right now it has first and last name. We have um, custom text field here and then an email address to send your, your evaluation. Um, so again, you can change these by hitting the pencil icon right there. And you can say a custom text field. Let's say um, um, you can put in whatever you want here. So are you interested in our newsletter? this and you can choose if this field is required to send or not I'm gonna leave it required and then I'll put my keep the information for the company right here as well looks like we can put it in their own company uh, if you wanted to add a new field you could add a new field and hit the pencil icon to actually edit it and you can see I can choose if I want it to be a name email phone uh, text box a custom field um, a checkbox, a pick list, or a team. Uh, so you have the option to play with these different settings um, and choose what you want people to fill in here. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and delete this though because I don't really want another one. Uh, below that we have a confirmation email. So the confirmation email the user gets after registering. Um, so this is what we'll send to the email address that they put into this form. Uh, so you can turn it on or off, but we can change the subject like, thanks for joining our newsletter. And then put your information in here that you want to send uh, to the potential customer or lead um, that will send in that email. Also, you can put a notification email in here as well. So uh, if I wanted to put, you know, office at birdseed.io, then whenever someone fills out this form to let me know they want to get uh, our newsletter and they've opted in, I'll get a notification that says, hey, this person just joined in. I can actually see the default reply. Um, I can change the um, subject. So someone just signed up for the newsletter. And that's the subject line that I'll receive. I can put in the information in here that I want. Like, hey, this person just signed up for the newsletter. And then the information will send the contact details that they filled out. So again, this is what you will receive at this email that's notified uh, whenever someone signs up. So you can get a notification at your email along with in your Birdseed panel. Uh, and then below there, we have our navigation icons. So you can choose what kind of icon you want. Right now we see that this one has a little paper icon. But you can change that. Like for instance, I'll change it to the mail. 
Uh, and then I can also upload a custom icon if I choose to, but I'm not gonna do that right now. And I'll go ahead and hit save. And as soon as I save this, now you see it says join our newsletter here and I am good to go. So if I go ahead and close this out, that will save my changes. Um, and now I have a new item in my panel that actually tells me, um, or excuse me, uh, encourages people to sign up for my newsletter inside of Birdseed. So uh, if you have any other questions, let us know and we'll be happy to help. Uh, thanks.